Okay, we're live. Okay, we're live. Um, sometimes Skype, good evening everybody, sometimes Skype messes it with it yesterday because I didn't use Skype, it turned off a microphone. Um, I had to delete the first two, so I'm hoping everybody that you can hear me. We are a bit later this evening, we've had a meeting which was awesome, and because um, we do have meetings in the background, and I just want to check that you can hear us. No, sorry, I've just got the catch up because we're like a minute behind. Yes, they can hear us. And there's me sitting there with my tablet looking at you going. Mm. I know. So yesterday, so when I went live yesterday, because I didn't use Skype, it turned off It turned off the internal microphone. You could hear the intro, but as soon as it, that come off, you couldn't hear me and I deleted those two, but they can hear us. Hello, Vicky. Good evening. How are you? We are on hump day. We're here to show off the artisan toolbox, which you just seen in the introduction. And um, hey, Dolly. And uh, Trina is hey. back, aren't you, my lovely? No, yes, I am here. Sorry, <laughs> I am here, yeah. Sorry, Nana Sue's back okay. as well. Nana Sue, I haven't seen you for ages. For some reason, Facebook really hates me and I cannot message you whatsoever. And I've been keeping a watch on all the things that you've been uploading. You're doing awesome. Love you, Nana Sue. My I, gosh. Think, I think your little granddaughter's in hospital, isn't she? I saw oh, something no. pop up. She's got something on her leg. Is that right? Matilda? Yeah, I think um, she's had an operation. I think, I think that's right. Um, well, so I hope she's okay. Matilda. Lots and lots of love. And hi, Cara. Hi, Amy. Hi, Dolly. My little Dolly mixture. Cara's um, away. Cara's away. Oh, she's been, been away. Good. She's been in Magaluf, baby. Oh, have a drink for me, love. I think I her mum's in Mexico now. Oh, Mexico. Arriba. Anyway. Let's 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 stop that. Enough of that. Now that I can see that Amy is on and I am back in the news with newsy news, can I please have the rainbow pooch? Oh, we have a new feature, my lovely. Oh, is this is it gonna you're gonna blow my mind now? Are you? Are you? I don't know. You'll see this, but I will bring the picture up in a minute. But right now, we have a little video going on with her beautiful wallet, and she's opening it and shutting it. Look at that. Well, I would, but it hasn't appeared on my screen yet, so I will in a sec. When uh, There it is! Oh, my God! Oh, can you, you clever lady? Yesterday, we had Dolly Rocker's um, beautiful bags opening and shutting. Oh, so it's can you have my mouth opening and shutting? <laughs> well, we could do that. Don't need to video for that. <laughs> anyway, Amy Sell of Rainbow Poochie. Now, these are wallets made using high-quality duct tape of all things they are duct tape I've never seen anything like it what a fabulous way to use something out of the ordinary and they're also vegan friendly because they're rubber adhesive how fascinating they come in a range of colors um, and you can if you can't see what you like she'll try and source it for you they are six pounds fifty plus postage and they keep all the things in them that you need they've got um, credit card slots in there and everything and, you know, we're all about the unique and the handmade. It's Father's Day coming up soon. I know that Andy needs a wallet. Might have to see if I can get some Liverpool-themed duct tape wallets coming at me. That's pretty cool. Go over, give her a love, a like. She's on Instagram. She's on Facebook. She has her own shop on the Marketplace. And this girl is epic. Also, big shout-out to her fella Pete. He's got a new business as well, doing embroideries and stuff. They go around all these craft fairs. She's been at one. They do biker festivals and all sorts. Awesome. I want a weekend away with Amy. I'll go and sell all of her merchandise just if I can stand in her shoes for 24 hours. We should, it all, go. Like so much. We should all go. We should have like a <laughs> madman meetup. That would be incredible. Where'd you go, Amy? Where'd she goes you go? all, over the gaff, all over the gaff. And I would like to say as well that she never, ever stops raving about her heart as and She's always checking bits of information while she's away. She's like, yeah, I've just spoken to the woman on the stall next door. And I've told her this. Is there anything else I can give to her? She's awesome. She's all about the love for Heart and I've never known someone work so hard as Amy. She's great and a gorgeous daughter Freya as well. Amy, do you ever come down our neck of the woods? Do you ever come down to uh, Gloucestershire or the Midlands or anything like that? Do you ever come near me? Well, if she doesn't, she's not far from me. She's about forty-five minutes from me down the M11, I think. She just said there's six slots on her um, wallets. Six slots. Yeah. 
And, uh, oh, Amy's in Durham this weekend. Oxford next weekend. Oh, Amy, Amy, I'm in Durham. I'm in Durham really soon. Not well, are you ten. soon at, at the weekend? Not this weekend, next weekend, but you know. Well, she's in Oxford the next weekend. You're bloody useless. Uh-huh. I'm all over the country this year. Vicky's just eaten burnt chicken wings. Fabulous. Down the M25 or round the M25. Never bloody stops. World's largest car park. Anyway, let's get back to the news. Well, you bugger off, dog. Did we say how much these were, honey? Yes, I did. They are £6.50 plus post and packaging. Perfect for Father's Day, I'll have you know. I want to but, this one more time. I do have I do have a question for you, Amy, as you're still here. The credit card slots, does it come with a free credit card as well? Because I'm skinned and I would really, <laughs> really like a credit card in with this wallet. Because if not, I think you may have to put that on your listing on the shop. This does not come with free money, Okay. I'll be very disappointed because did you know, I don't know if this would apply to you lot, whenever my mum buys me a purse or the children a purse, she always puts a pound coin in it. It doesn't matter how old I've been, I've always yeah. got that pound coin because apparently it's bad luck to give a wallet. With my no nan did it. that, my nan did that and I've always done it. How funny that, and it's something I've always remembered and then when I had my I children, because I used to work in pubs. So I was always, always in the pub and the children were always with me, whether I was checking a shift or they were coming to meet me for lunch or whatever. Um, But whenever someone new met them, they would always give them a pound or 50p because you're supposed to cross a baby's palm with silver. But and, And there's all these things that, you know, that really stick in my head now. It's very strange. I think it's brought the crafty out in me as well. Vicky said, always put silver in. The other Vicky says, I know what you're going to say, Trina. It's bad luck if given it empty. No money in them. Should be copper or 20 pence. Ah, oh, okay. Ooh. So there's probably lots of different ways of doing it, isn't there? But it's something that my family does. It's like the tooth fairy. I'll never I'll never forget my daughter come home one day. And she's like, I can't wait to lose my tooth. I was like, it can be arranged. <laughs> she, was like, she was like, what? I said, why anyway? I said, it's just inconvenient. It's difficult to eat. And she went, yeah, but my friend just got a fiver from the tooth fairy. I was like, a fiver? How much is inflation? I used to get like 20p. What is this fiver? How many is? teeth do you get? God, that's a lot of money. They never got yeah. a fiver, like to add. They never got a fiver. No. But anyway, Tooth Fairy in my house uh, sent text messages and all sorts. <laughs> <laughs> Mummy's creative. Anyway, £50 notes, please. No. <laughs> right, next up, can we please have, it's a Love Heart necklace, and it's by Love Ella Jewelry, Nicola Armstrong. I've asked this question before. Does anybody know why she's called Love Ella Jewelry when her name is Nicola? Maybe your daughter or a family? Yeah, I want to know who Ella is. I want to know if it's we a family. We need to know more family. about you, Nicola. Nicola does know we're on this evening, so... Oh, I'll, really? I hope she pops I'll up. I'll pop this back into the Artisan Toolbox because we have our own groups um, and we're, we're hopefully she'll watch it. And That's a heart, by the way. Yeah, I know it's a heart. It cracks me up. Absolutely that's cracks me up. That's a different shaped one. I haven't got one that shape. Do you know why it makes me laugh? Because I've noticed now when you put a poster up and you're like, we're doing the news, everyone will find the one thing they've got with a heart on it because they know you'll love it. (laughs) I do love it. I do love it. Tell me about it. Tell you a bit about it then. It's a beautiful, irregular shaped heart pendant in chunky silver plated chain. It really adds something to the beautiful necklace. I think because the chain is slightly chunkier and with the offset heart, it really does go well it's 15 pounds and comes with an 18 inch chain however get down g dog um you can choose the chain length as well there are some beautiful things on the marketplace shop and yeah i really want to know more about you oh there she is thank you for showing mine nicola please tell me there we go why are you called love ella jewelry because obviously your name is nicola is ella a family member someone important in your life is it your middle name or do you just like it tell me i need to know this information is going to bug me if i don't have it please tell me it's absolutely beautiful but go over share us some love you know like a page follow us see what she is up to um are you on instagram my love because if so i don't believe that i follow you and i should definitely pop over also please tweet her too um 
and join in. We're going to be running games as well this week. So all you crafties who are in our crafters, our imaginarium, our artisan toolbox, pop over and play. There will be quirky prizes and you can get to know some of us as well. We do like to natter, as you can tell. So Nicola, we've just been telling um, what Tween has because she's the voice. Um, we've just been telling everyone how much it is, what it's made of, the size of it, and also a bit about you. Heartisan's all about sharing stories and um, getting them out there. So the more you can tell us about yourself, we can really um, there we go. People connect with with stories. Oh, I really wish I'd never asked. Okay, <sighs> give me a minute. Right, I've just found out, I've just been told that Ella is um, Nicola's beautiful daughter's name and unfortunately she was stillborn so by keeping her in her life this is dedicated to her. I'm ever so sorry, <laughs> I do get very emotional over things like this but I think that is such a beautiful thing to do and what a lovely legacy and then every piece of jewellery that is made is clearly made with even more love than you can imagine now. I really want one of these necklaces now. I want them for my daughters. <laughs> oh, right, can we make one? Can we ask her just what else she makes? Because obviously she's fairly new to Hartazan. And this is the first time we've shown you. What are the... You'll have to ask her. <laughs> yeah, I know. What other things do you make, um, Nicola? Is it all jewellery or do you do lots and lots of different things? Hi, Chelsea. <laughs> Just and having an emotional moment. <laughs> I'll I talk for a minute. She can... Um... No, she doesn't have mind us thing. asking at all. So um, what we also do, um, that um, we have Emma within uh, Artisan Toolbox who organises... Um, she's been putting posts up and I am not, they don't always get seen, but you can come on one-to-one -one with either myself, we're going to get Toria and Vicky doing that. Um, and spreading the load a little bit so you can come on talk about your stories the stories are absolutely um the way to go obviously you you say what you want want um to say um but if that's something you want to do there is a post up already i believe in the artisan toolbox um so far it's jewelry absolutely awesome um what a lovely way to keep Ella's memory alive it absolutely is you're right then trina yeah, I'm, I'm all good. I'm ever so sorry. This is why I could never read news on like ITV or BBC because I couldn't talk about um, world events, you know, all the atrocities and things. I'd be like, oh my God, the cathedral is burning. Quick, let's get a fire engine and go and help. That's me all over. So, so there it is. One more time. There it is. Beautiful. It is. It is absolutely stunning. I'm ever so sorry. I don't normally react to things so quickly, but what a beautiful story to tell. And yeah. Love Ella Jewelry. Please go over, share some love and follow. I've pulled myself together now. Right. Next up, can we please have the lovely Dolly Mixtures Little Hoops. See, I didn't know she did these until quite recently. She does. Um, I've seen... She doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> but I've this seen... This is, can I just say, because you probably don't know, this is the other half of Dolly. Well, this is the nice half. <laughs> This Dolly doesn't actually make these. This is the other half of Dolly Walker who does this, which is her sister. Oh, I did not know that. Don't know everything, see? You don't know everything. Oh, I feel <laughs> really left out now. Dolly mixture, how could you? How could you? Oh, sorry, Nicola, don't ever be sorry for making me cry because when I hear of stories like that, it makes me even more determined to show your stuff and share you because it has come from such a special place. And you know what? News isn't rehearsed. News is always thrown together. You know, it's from people's products. And I like to be at least realistic on here. And those are the type of things that our viewers like to know about you. They feel connected to you. And, you know, when people have a story similar to yours, then it can bring you two together as well. And it just gets the word out there and awareness. So don't ever apologise. Yeah. And thank you for sharing it with us. Yeah, it's what Heart Design is absolutely all about. Um, Amy knew she was a sister team. Uh, See, Vicky, Vicky did as well. That. Vicky did as well. But vaguely remember mentioning that on news. Oh, uh, now you think. Uh, <laughs> I actually don't. I have no recollection of it. <laughs> Tell us about them. Tell us about them. But now we know. Um, these the are apple one is really good for teachers. Sorry, I just noticed that's an apple one. That'd be really good for teachers because we're thinking it is. 
And it would be a great thank you gift. Now, these, I would like to say that they're Dolly Rockers, but now they're not. So now I need to know your sister's name because I'm a bit pants. And oh, I uh, know it. has put this forward. Nine pounds, free post and packaging, um, bespoke keepsake hoop. Now, they come with a choice of four Liberty fabrics. As you can see, she's displayed three, I think. Yeah, three there. And a heart. Oh, look at that. Another heart, Chrissy. Cow. I know. Two hearts, <laughs> Two hearts. Now, there are various shapes. She's done the heart and the apple here, but I would imagine you can have pretty much anything that you wanted. Dolly's a bit good like that, and uh, I'm sure her sister is as well. Um, the four messages are available at the moment. You can see just underneath those shapes, just for you, thank you, with love, or happy birthday. They are a modest five inches, so it wouldn't overpower a small space, and it would just add that little bit of decorative charm to your home. I think they are perfect, or even a school or an office, because we were saying about teachers. Now, can I just say that, as I don't know Dolly's lovely sister's name, Dolly Rocker herself... It's on, it's on there for you. I've put it up there. Gillian. Gillian. Gillian, my darling. All right, Vicky, you big show off. Gillian, Gillian I think. Oh, yeah, see, I knew, Trina. I knew. All right, Miss Newsy. Oh, my I... God. Sorry, there's a moth in my house. <laughs> Good. I hope it gets you. Anyway... <laughs> Oh, a serious, serious um, thingy with moths. Oh, my God. <laughs> but Dolly does these magical makeup bags, and I'm assuming you showed this yesterday as you said the video was working. Um, I have one of those. I've got one for my daughter in unicorn patterns. I think they're awesome. I love all of Dolly's stuff. She just... She just does. And, you know, clearly her sister Gillian is twice as talented. <laughs> and the reason I say twice as talented is because I didn't know in the first place. I hate you all. Anyway, <laughs> only kidding. But, yeah, £9, go over, have a look. Does, um before I, I go on, actually, does Gillian have her own page or does she help you with Dolly Rocker? She's a teacher. What does she teach? School stuff. School <laughs> Fine, whatever. Maybe I still need to buy a makeup bag for my holiday. Yes, you do. Did you know that they're wiped clean inside? And you don't just have to use them for makeup either. Because, you know, travelling, I'd shovel my sandwiches in there. No, you're not having them. It's me personal bits. They're not going through the detector. See, that's what I'd do. I want me crisps and stuff on the plane. Anyway, Dale, pick a mix gift. I don't need to tell you what this is because you're going to find it automatically. Oh, and guess what these are? Are they hearts? Yeah. Oh, my yeah. gosh, yes, they are hearts. <laughs> blissful moments, I'll have you know. They're not just any heart. They're a blissful moment. All six of them are blissful. So, they are handmade using the finest Belgian chocolate because our Dale wouldn't use anything else because he would like to bring the delights of the chocolatier to your front door. And this is why they're available to buy on the marketplace. Pick and mix parties and gifts. Now... They are filled, melting, or they filled with melting smooth, rich and velvety, a chocolate centre. Oh, yes. See, I'm, I'm a bit weird, though. See, if I have these, they have to go in the fridge until they go rock hard, and then I can bite them. I'm such a weirdo with chocolate. Um, the hearts are available. They come in a pack of six, and you know what I haven't done? Written the blooming price. But I do know it. Let me have a look. Let me have a look. So I, yeah, you, you carry on, let me have a look. Vicky's just saying she tried them. Uh, I'll put that comment over your face, sorry. Um, Vicky tried some of Dale's chocolates on Sunday and they were epic. I took them and we shared them everywhere. I said this the other day. And, yeah, um, did. Kids were giving them out and it was just, people were like, these are absolutely incredible. Where are they? It's like, hot as that. <laughs> well, they either come in honey or hazelnut at the moment. Uh, most of Dale's chocolates are actually vegan friendly. So if you buy the dark chocolate version, then it would be vegan friendly. Um, Dale tries to cater for all the markets that he can. He's just had a fabulous run over Easter. I was lucky enough to be sent some of his hazelnut no it wasn't hazelnut was such a liar honeycomb chocolate slab and there was another one as well i literally got a bite out of each and then the kids stole it and i never saw it again when i went to visit oh by the way i've put something in the post for you today your pens are on their way back my love oh, I've, got um, them. I've got them they can have got them i sent them today i can tell you i got them i can tell you i got them did i not go to... oh no it wasn't today it was yesterday <laughs> 
God, that was quick. My heart, special heart to some I meant to say earlier. This is the only I'm word. Offended. This is the only We're word not. in existence. Heart is unlimited. Stride Gloucestershire. It's got the postcode of the unit and everything. I know, I stole it. <sighs> stole it. Um, the, the chocolates are £6 each, darling. Oh, I did write it. It says pack of six and then £6 next to it. <laughs> Yes, you know okay. what? We, my, he did our Easter uh, eggs, obviously, because we've got vegans in the house, and they had um, the controllers because my kids are gamers and stuff. Okay. And my, and mine didn't last very long. Uh, I, I, you know, I got to admit, it, they didn't last very yeah, long. One. Kids, <laughs> kids have still got theirs. Nearly all gone now, but didn't they do well with that? I was like, yeah, go on. <laughs> right, next up, can I have the lovely Vicky B, the one and only. Lady Bannister. She does the iPad and tablet case. Now it says iPad slash tablet case because they are suitable for most models of both. These have actual handwriting on them. She takes them. She does very, very clever things. And did you know, if you're a bit useless with keeping things like I am, so if it's been shoved in a drawer, like, you know, I have my memory keepsake drawer where all my important stuff goes and then I tend to ram it shut because it's so like full and get little creases in the paper well our whiz kid over here can remove those creases she can take the handwriting as it is get rid of smudges blotches she's a super whiz right now these particular ones they have padded for pr uh, protection against dust and scratches it's a double zip closure and it does fit <sighs> most standard tablets now the approximate size is 21 by 29 centimeters so if your tablet is any larger than that it's not going to fit however if you needed something making or sourced like that or larger or smaller then do get in touch with her vicky is fabulous i've had a cushion made by vicky and it was sent to uh, a friend of mine she did all the work herself i pretty much had an idea and went can you do this i sent her some pictures and went can you mess with it i wasn't very specific at all which is not very good when you're giving somebody a plan but she did absolutely shock me it was beautiful it's been very well received and i know the person who has it sits with it every day so that's really good i uh, um i saw some of her work on sunday um she made a hoodie with heart as all over it it was absolutely gorgeous and um she also we had donya there and uh from prue shoes and she made donya a bag and it's beautiful and she's given me a present and as much as i really want to look what's in it it's i haven't looked vicky um, oh, honestly oh, god i could show it you there is a oh, present on the side for me so oh, i know cool. what it is. You know what it is? Oh, shesh. No, yes, yeah, shesh. <laughs> I need to talk to um, Vicky about um, Jacob's TA as well. I really need to sort that. I know there's a couple of months yet, but I want something really special for him. I'm, I'm not sure what it's going to be, but... She did, She'll say, do she like to did say that she's trying to find laptop ones, and um, yeah, I need those, because I'd have heart as and cut beds all over it. I want a Hartazan hoodie. Yay. Not until May the 28th. I will not open it till May the 28th. And do you know what? When we do the festival, we all need the Hartazan hoodies. We do. Well, I'll tell you what. If you need a hoodie, to be fair, I've got my business hoodie from Carly Walters at Bow Cottage. Mm. It's as brand new looking as it was the day I got it. I ordered it. It was with me within two days. I sent her my logo. It was done. And literally, it's been through the wash so many times because I always live in it. In fact, I wore it to your house. Yeah, you did. No, Vicky did this one. The Vicky one that did your own hoodie, did she? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it was very, it was quite last minute, bless her. And I'm like, so that's what it's, I haven't got it. I should bring it here. But um, I was like, you know what? We we're just talking together, and I was like, I really need it done. So um, she did it within a day or something, and brought it with me, and it was all. I so did not know that she did her days. Oh my god, I need one for everybody. Oh, she does everything. Stuff. I really hope that my kid does not see this. Naomi is obsessed with her days. She wants one in every color. She wants to design her own. Oh, my God. She's going to end up having me get, like, a press or something. I'll be like, no, there's enough heartisanas that can do it for you. I'm not doing that, too. Anyway, and she does T-shirts as but, well. Uh, Cara said, I love hoodies. I need to get business and heartisan ones. Um, Zach's still got it in his room. I need to go and rescue it back. 
Right, well, we're not talking hoodies. So this I... Sorry, sorry. Yeah. We digress a lot. We don't. We, you haven't said that in a long time, have you? I digress. No. £20 plus post and packaging. Now, lots of people do find it quite difficult in their business to produce white writing. Well, this is something that Vicky B can do. She's also got watercolours available as well. If you don't see something that you are looking for, get in touch with her. She has her own magical marketplace. I do believe she sells on other platforms too. You will find her on Instagram. You will find her on Facebook. You will find her on Twitter. And I do believe she's the queen of something, is she not? Queen of expressive gifts and that also brings me to um rainbow poochie she is queen of summer and all <laughs> summer <laughs> and all it's on instagram check us out on instagram there we post what's the question vicky the other vicky's in here as well she's the queen of resin pendants aren't you a queen of something i was the first queen I yeah like, I, knew it. You know. I knew it i am the queen of fabulous and I the order of fabulous like which is, oh, what did you just say? I said I'd only be a drag queen. <laughs> <right. laughs> That's what I said, mine was. <laughs> Mate, we have the queen of marketplace. That's obviously Hartazans. We have the queen of century items and the queen of the order of fabrice. Fabulous. Uh, Amy is queen of dream catchers. Vicky is queen of bespoke writing gifts. And this is something that we help all our artisans, crafters, and imaginariums do. Exit time are worse, and I won't do it yet. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, can I uh, with say? Can I just say, Sue, Sue, Nanny Sue just um, popped up, and we went past the comment, but so I put it on the search. She says, "Hi, girls, I'm back home now, and I've missed you all so much." Oh, Miss Susan. Susan, I love you so much. I hope your little granddaughter is, is much, much better. And I hope you are just happy and lovely as you always are. I love Nana Sue. I really love Nana Sue. I want Nana Sue as my Nana. She's just awesome. Amy oh, also said, don't forget Dale is king of chocolate. Do you know what? We should do a live with them all on. Well, I've got another, I think I've got another queen of here. Isn't Toria a queen of? Pretty sure she is. And then we have Erica, who is one of the Twitter sisters. There's a creative... She's creative Biz Awards along as well. With, along with... Um, um, someone of social media. That was you me, and Dale got that. Dale, yep. And um, I'm getting a whole thing that we'll be sending our crafters all done in um, heart and colours on that we'll be able to send. Um, we will. And I know that the other Vicky got um, um, Creative Biz Awards as well, didn't she? And Carly. Yep. Um, and Earth Gems has had it. So that is all a lot to do with Erica, Erica, and the crafters display crew. Get on that. And obviously, we do it in Imaginary and in our son and remind people. So that's what we're all about because um, awards are awesome for your businesses. Yes, they are. But next up, can we please have the Fabric Scissor Keepers? And I know you know who they are because I know you either want some or have some. I want some. I have and... some. I showed you them in my unit. Yes, that was it. You have some. Um, Fabric Scissor Keepers by the gorgeous, the lovely, the wonderful Angela Pickhaver of Gorgeous Gifts. I learned something absolutely fascinating the other day, right? I was on her um, I was on her marketplace shop and it said something about Cornish Celtic. And I was really confused because I'd only ever heard of um, Celtic being to do with Scottish or Irish or uh, Welsh. And I was just like, Cornish, really? So I Googled it. And then the lovely Rachel <clears throat> started explaining it to me and that how it all came from there as well. And I was like, oh, my God, fascinating. So not only was I learning to shop, I learned facts as well. But these are whimsical hanging scissor keepers. They keep them away from tiny hands or, in my case, the dog or just stop me from losing them. Um, they are satin ribbon tied. They are £4.75 plus post and packaging. They have two little buttons for details and they are hand or machine washable. But do put them on a delicate cycle and don't tumble dry them. Lie them nice and flat works out a lot better she does so many different varieties if you can't see a fabric that you want then give her a message see if she can source it for you she does these little desk buddies as well like penguins and pirates and all sorts she i found out that she does alterations as well mm -hmm. there is no end to this woman's talent she also keeps the artisan page ticking over and her gorgeous daughter Faye has also recently joined us too 
So welcome, Faye. Yeah, she's helping us on Pinterest as well. Can I just quickly just pop in there? She's also in our auction and she's donated one of her amazing hampers, which I actually have bidded on. Oh, it's the red one, isn't it? Mine. No, I'm having one with pink hearts. I think it's the red one on there, but it's all hearts. And, oh. Um, yes. See, I can't have it yet until I find a, um, an overlocking stitch machine-y thingy. <laughs> I went into my... Um, Charity shop the other day, found a singer. It's 25 quid, but it was made in like 1970. Probably so, no, don't. Duh, probably would no. work, but you might have to like, you know, pedal it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, I need one that does everything for me. I'm just, no, no. Uh, yeah, see, a whole other language. See, I just can't believe all the stuff that I didn't know about Cornwall. And I love the coast. I want to go down and learn all about it from Angela, just from reading her page. Fascinating. Yeah, we'll have to have another madman trip down to Cornwall. <laughs> yeah, we will. Come Here on. we go. There's a choice between red, so you were right, pink or multicoloured hearts. Mm. Pink, red, pink or multicoloured. I like that. Like that. Next up, can we please have uh, Bernadette Rose and Quest felt flowers love wreath, please? These are twenty five pounds plus post and packaging. And um, the one thing I really, really love about the facts on her page, where she does the about me, she married her high school sweetheart, her childhood sweetheart. I love that. I love that. That to me is just love right there. How can you put up with the same irritating person for that long? I want to throttle Andy after a few hours. <laughs> But no, I think that's amazing. These are £25 plus post and packaging. Now, what I love about these is not only are they bright and fun and remind me so much of spring, each of those flowers, are the petals are hand cut, hand drawn, hand shaped to create each individual flower. It takes so much time and dedication and I don't think people often realise that it's her creating those flowers herself to adorn the wreath with. I think some people just think that they're bought and then put on. No, everything that you see has been made by her. All those flowers hand cut by her. This is a 10 inch hoop. Now, if you allow probably another two inches for the leaves and the foliage, because it would make the package bigger and obviously the wreath itself bigger. Um, yeah, she does um, hanging wool decorations as well. Wool, um, they've got like little love birds. She does some really beautiful things over there. Um, yeah, I just think it's gorgeous. Sorry, my phone is going, not my phone, my tablet's going. Around. Faraday, hey, lovely. See, I said your name right today. Check me out. She I've also does the most amazing reefs as well. And I, I know I've said it before on um, market on, on lives, but she made me one. I, well, I bought one of hers off the marketplace that are done with book pages. So um, Trina would probably love that. I have, I've it's seen it. It's just beautiful. And, um, yeah, that's my Christmas um, decoration. Although, in all fairness, I could probably put that any time of year. Yeah. Uh, it is, it's still an all in my Christmas stuff. But, um, so gorgeous, though. I just think they're so <laughs> clever. We have a wreath in the auction. How very nice. Do we? Uh, what wreath do we hanging. have? What wreath do we have? that the scissor catchers uh, the scissor keepers would be good for hairdressing scissors as well and she'd love to have some in her bag save her fingers great oh, idea oh you do hair as well come and do mine Nicola it's a mess it needs cutting I, yeah, I've got one of those um, scissor ones as you know but that's so I don't lose them <laughs> yeah mine would be so I don't lose them Next up, can we have Toria's? Right, I had to check with her. I had to say it phonetically. Is it Unakite or is it Unakite? It's Unakite. Unakite bare copper pendant. Now, these are being sold for $34.95. It's a hand woven pendant using bare copper wire. Now, the pendant itself measures about one and a half inches in height and one inch in width. Um, it comes currently on a 16 inch black pendant cord and it's also presented in a gift box. If you did want it, obviously at a longer length, you'd have to drop her a message. I'm not sure if this incurs a separate charge, but there are so many beautiful things on there. I mean, I've seen a blue one. I did ask her about it. She's like, oh, I've got to have a look. And she did send me one, which I love already. And it's... Um, lapis lazuli i think it is but the one i've seen is a brighter blue and i know it's hers i just have to go and find it but she takes so much care with these as well she doesn't just do these she does the tree of life she does like little um 
what are they called what's the purple one amethyst she does them in amethyst and all different gems you can find them you can the pink one <laughs> no it's not pink no does she do a pink one oh, yeah she does everything in pink and it'd be for stop it you're not allowed any more pink stuff uh, no. no you've seen my you've seen my um my son's Oh, ah. there you go. She just said, if you do need a longer cord, then you won't um, be charged extra I know, for I it. I popped it up. Um, yeah. My son's dad bought me a jewelry box. It's not a jewelry box, it's a jewelry mirror. And it's huge. You've seen it, haven't you? I met <laughs> <stuff. It's cool. laughs> There is so much stuff there. Yeah, but do you know what, though? There you go. She's got a pink one, a blooming new she would. They are. They are so pretty. But she does so many different things. She also does crocheting and all sorts. There is no end to this woman's yeah. talent. Victoria, can I just ask? Because I see your um, pendants around. So that actually comes with a chain. It's a cord. A cord. Same it's, thing. Uh, yeah, got, you, it's actually yeah. ready to wear is what I'm asking. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's okay. ready to wear. Um, but... She doesn't just do these as well. And I would like to say that Toria is one of our madmen. She takes so when you see us all over Twitter and it's heart is and this and heart is and that, oh, we've got these deals running and this is May Mayhem, that's Toria. That's our madmen that takes hold of Twitter and makes sure that all of our information is out there. So she's not just a pretty face behind all this gorgeous jewellery. She does, does work really hard for heart is and as well. So go over, give us we some love. Victoria's trinket. We will be doing our own Twitter hour soon. You know, we're talking about the awards and everything. We will be doing our own. So that will be coming in June. Oh, my notes are attacking me. Right, next, next up, um, can we have the wedding glasses, please? Oh, yeah. I, I know these quite well, actually, because I was looking at these on Heart is Our Marketplace the day wedding before yesterday. Season, isn't it? It's wedding season. It is season i want to get married but i'm already married God, I do. <laughs> but if i get married you've all got to come you see so because you know it wouldn't be right without you all would it but these are a pair of wedding glasses you can see they are supposed to be bride and groom now these are from lisa waterworth of gift creations these are 16.99 to 19.99 depending on what you would like uh, it's a set of two obviously and they are made from fine glitter and rhinestone embellishments they are hand decorated so no two would ever be the same she doesn't just do glasses she does frames as well she does tumblers she does all sorts of things and they are all as equally beautiful as the next she does quite a lot of glitter work i wouldn't have a steady enough hand i really wouldn't it just look like a mess if i did it <laughs> these to me are what actually made me giggle was I didn't realise that they were glitter at first. What I thought she'd done was made like little stem holders and like, little, like a little like suit jacket <laughs> oh type. God. Oh, God. I thought she made. Oh, I honestly thought that they were like made from fabric. Oh. And then I, I thought, Plumber now she's got them at a really it's very, close fit. And it's she? very good. It is very good. And then I realised that it was glitter and was actually stuck to the glass and that I am, in fact, a massive moron. <laughs> so, yeah. Well, you said but that. Anyway, <laughs> I did, but at least I they come. Do these come in the pair, then? They obviously come in the pair, don't they? Yeah, they come in a pair. Step two. And this is going to die on me. Please don't die. Please don't die. I love your time. Okay, what we got next, my lovely? Um, wool baby booties, please, from the lovely Davina in Disco. In, in indigo <laughs> sky to knit see this is why i had time off yesterday because and i slept for like the entire time best night's sleep of my life um yeah wool baby booties 12 pounds 50 now perfect baby shower gifts these are rainbow with shades of pink they are 100 percent merino wool they are the pattern is mon petit violon I don't know if that is how you pronounce it, but that's as French as you get in. I'm very, very sorry. Um, they come in 0 to 6 months or 6 to 12 months, and they are from the lovely Davina Indigo Sky 2 Knits. Now, look at how adorable they are. I want to give her a message to see if she'll knit me some, like, slippers like that, because I just think they're great, but I'd have to keep him away from the dog. He's got a bit of a slipper fetish. I'd also like to say that Davina has recently... 
um, started doing crochet and knitting courses online you can also purchase these from her shop on the marketplace she's in the beta testing phase at the moment so if it is something that you're interested in pop over read the terms and conditions you could actually get yourself a massive bargain before it explodes and then there'll be no room left because I want to learn as well there isn't a craft on this earth that I don't want to learn right now so if you're all selling stuff come at me because I might actually join up I've got issues but she does some beautiful things she has cardigans she does jumpers she does little booties go over have a look she is awesome Brina. ah Lisa we just had Brina. you on. ah I was just gonna say I'm just quickly popping up the glasses just for our lovely Lisa yeah I don't know if you heard that Lisa I was convinced that you tailored these little outfits for your glasses <laughs> I am in fact a moron and then realized that you have done this remarkable job with really fine glitter and hats off to you I think they're outstanding and if I was getting married I would be coming to you for the gift absolutely beautiful I really really like them Lisa do and you think this- I was just gonna say did you do anything for like Father's Day with um like beer glasses or anything like that I just wondered because um we need to do a Father's Day one again don't we we do we do lots of people have been uploading Father's Day stuff at the moment some really cool things I know we did one for Facebook pages outside of Partisan but we should do one for Partisan too Yes, we should. Yep. Yes, so, we should. I've got two more to get on. What you got? I don't think that's me. Uh, so we can either do the peaked beanie. Got it. Or we. Okie dokie. Now this. I was talking to, and I was talking about Angela and Gorgeous Gifts. Now, this is one of her daughters. This is Faze. Now, she is from World Delights. This is a peaked adult crochet beanie. Now, I like these. They're very in fashion at the moment. £23.50 with £3.99 postage. Now, it's a soft peaked brim. It has a textured top and sides with a button detail. They are hand wash owned, uh, no, they are hand wash or machine wash on a very gentle cycle and do not tumble dry them now lots of people will say but that's wool you know we're just now in summer well let me just tell you the way that this has been crocheted it's suitable for any kind of weather because the wool is breathable so it's possible to keep your head cool and out of the sun in the sunny times or it's good to keep your head warm in the winter it's very very versatile um i do i don't know actually if there are other colors available Faye, if you're on here give me a shout out she's brand new to the marketplace and her listings will be flying up before your eyes and this is the first one so pop over and have a look i think it's great i really really like that and that's the kind of hat that i can just about get away with wearing i have a very odd shaped head i don't like a bit of a i can't wear hats i just can't wear them but um this is hot off the press isn't it absolutely hot off. it is just i literally just day. stole it see the person who is a headgear queen is our very lovely dolly dolly she's always got something around her bonds isn't she yeah. i like her little like band things Do you know what i love about them because obviously i have um the same supplier as dolly for fab yeah and I know they're all like parts of the fabric. She's just amazing. She always does bits with them. Can I just can I just talk to um, Lisa a minute? She said no. she can do. Shh, I can do something indeed. I usually do them to order as personalised. So probably when I get back from my time in Sunderland, I will be shopping for um, Father's Day stuff. So I would like one of Faraday's cards. I want some coffee from Coffee Monkey up, which I'm actually bidding on, I think, on the auction. And then I'd love um, some kind, and a travel mug. And then I'd love some kind of beer mug or something. So um, you can get one up on the marketplace or message me or something. would be awesome. Yeah. I'm sorry, I love the beanie. A hat hides a multitude of hair issues. Hair issues? I don't know what you mean. <laughs> yes, both of us put our hair up today. <laughs> I never do this. I never <laughs> put mine up. <laughs> no one will see. And last but by no means least, can we have the amigurumi? I love that word. Yeah, but I've learned how to say it. I wouldn't even attempt it, but I love it. I sat with Google. Amigurumi, amigurumi, amigurumi. See, I can do it later now. It's great. Anyway, these are currently... 
crocheted by hand by our lovely Carla. It's a hatching unicorn egg. It's currently nine pounds, uh, but it's in the sale and should be 10 pounds. It's five inches roughly for any of you mad unicorn fans. We have a resident one in my house. Everything is pink and unicorn like. Um, she just loves it. But yeah, she doesn't just do these ones either. There are loads of things she does on there, but her usual stuff is personalized bag tags, uh, love tokens, she does all sorts of things on there. And she's also a teacher and one of our marvelous mad men. Um, now she doesn't normally put her stuff up on here. She takes care of the crafters display. So it's quite nice to have Carla on here. Um, yeah, buy one, why not? And if you don't want one, handmade by Carla Louise see if she has got anything for you especially for Father's Day uh, all of you all of you who have men in your life who are addicted to Xbox or PlayStation or what have you I have one like that she's got gamers ca uh, gamer tags for like personalized key rings there's bottle openers there's all sorts of things on there so go over have a look handmade by Carla Louise uh, she's a bit crafty our Carla and that's <laughs> a bit you. crafty <laughs> a bit crafty she's just a little bit she's into all sorts that girl and she runs crafters display as well with the lovely Erica so if you have anything you want to ask her if you've got anything that you want her to make for you go over and bug her I'll give you permission I'm sure she'll love it um I'm working on getting a bee one. Ooh, bee, a bee what oh from Carla a bee with uh yeah and that's all I've got and I'm, I'm all gonna have a quick you. look on because as I can obviously comment in the comments as well I've asked Lisa to put Jacob on it to daddy and she said uh, she's going to design something on Sunday and let you know. Awesome. I will forget because obviously um, it's got a crap memory. <laughs> I will forget. So just message. She will forget. I will. So that's it. I'm not going to do a lineup because we have been on a very long time. And to be fair, I'm tired. And I've got still the book to write. So, you know. Well, I've got Marketplace Biz to do. So I shall speak to you all later. Um, before we go, when are we next on? Because I missed it yesterday. So does that mean I owe you one? No, because I'm changing the days. I'm just going to hang out with Trina in a minute. I am taking Mondays off from now on um, because the Friday stuff didn't work very well or at the weekends. So I'm going to have the Mondays off to try and um, do completely Rejig. nothing. Oh, so I was thinking Tuesdays for Insta Instagram, Tuesdays for Imaginarium, today's for our, um, our Sun Toolbox, oh, and then Thursdays for crafters and then people will know and then Angela can do the Fridays and Saturdays to get people on as well. In Sunday we're getting rude so be there or be we square. We are getting rude however I do want us to get together and do a little bit of the auction. Sunday the naughty is coming yes it is. The only thing is I do have to say is I am going to be away so I'm probably not going to be up for this if you could get Toya or maybe Vicky up on that week yeah, or we just sure take a break or whatever we get even if anyone jumps on because i am going to have a week off you need a week you need, need a week. you need longer than a week you do anyway you lovely lot we're gonna go because well we've got things to do and well then they've got nothing else to talk about so <laughs> yeah thanks very much for watching and we will see you tomorrow subscribe to youtube see you bye